listen to that sizzling glaze. All right, guys, Jack and Dan here with another little holiday special. This is a plant-based ham-style roast from Tofurky. We did a video on this a couple years ago when we first tried one. Um, Jack really wanted to have this, like, for a Christmas dinner kind of thing. We're going to be gone his entire Christmas break. We're going to Vegas. But uh, I thought it would be kind of cool to have one of these little things because he really liked it. I saw it in the store. We were over there at Myers. Uh, Tofurky makes awesome stuff. I mean, quite honestly, they make tons of awesome stuff. This is pretty much a block of tofu. It's like 110 grams of protein in this thing and some sodium, and that's about it. Not something we would get all the time. We don't use a lot of tofurkey or meat substitutes, but it's fun to get something like this once in a while. One of the main reasons he wanted to do this is because it comes with this amazing little bourbon glaze, and he wants to paint that on while it rotisseries in our new oven slash air fryer rotisserie. Look at that little ham in there. How cool is that? It looks just like a little ham. They package it up. It's got the twine and everything on it. You got to cut that off and everything. I don't know if there's a picture on here at all. Nah, I took it out already. But anyway, it's all bound up like a little ham. So there it is going around the little rotisserie thing. We got this at Costco. This oven is like on sale. We got it like, I don't know, six months ago. We've done a couple videos on it. But anyway, so when he's done with his homework, I'm going to surprise him. He's in the back doing his homework. I'm over here making dinner. Got some leftover pierogies for my birthday in the oven on the stone there cooking those up with the convection oven to get them crispy. Got some green beans, one of his favorite things. And then gonna throw on the old crispy oven onions on top of those. So we're gonna have a big, huge meal. Pamela's working real late, so we're just gonna crush this. If she's lucky, she might get some leftovers. She's never tried this. She's not a huge fan of ham. She's never really eaten ham. Chances are she probably won't even want it. So we'll have some leftovers. Um, last time I got this, it was quite some time ago. I will tell you this, it's amazingly similar to ham um, without the gross factor. So basically like no fatty taste or anything like that, but it's great. You can slice it, you can make sandwiches out of it. Um, and again, there's five servings and every serving has 22 grams of protein. Stuff's amazing. So I'm gonna have Jack come up here because he is wanting to, you know, paint the glaze on there. So he's doing his homework. I'm gonna go get him. All right, so Jack's super excited. He's got his glaze. It smells still scrumptious. You can't, you can't wait to glaze this ham, huh? Crazy. I'm gonna open it. Jack's gonna reach in there. We got the bottom pan on, because of course it's gonna drip. Ooh, listen to that sizzling glaze. Wowza. <laughs> I'll close it so it turns around, okay? Yeah. Close it for a second. Let it rotate a half of a rotation or so. Oh, look at that. Wow, that's awesome. Go ahead and get the other side. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? I mean, it really does look like a little miniature ham. Yeah, it does. It, you know, they put it in a little net. It this is a great option if you have people in your family that are plant-based and you want to make them something special if they're coming over for a holiday. Or if you're plant-based and you want to take something to a holiday... Um, quite honestly, we have taken this to family get-togethers and people cut it up into cubes and ate it. And we're like eating it with potatoes and stuff. And they're like, it tastes just like ham to us. Like it was really, it was really kind of neat. All right, we're just about out of this glaze. Jack has glazed and lathered the ham about five or six times it's now. It's like caramelized. Oh yeah. So we're going to let that puppy bake for another five or ten in there and one casualty there look at those brown and crispy beautiful pierogies those are gonna be awesome green beans are cooking up there a couple more minutes here oh I'm getting hungry look at it just spinning around like that beautiful Let's see what we got going on definitely gonna be a nice crunchy outside to it Look at that. Nice and steamy. Yeah. I think I'm just going to eat half if you want the other half. Yeah, it's probably what's going to go on. Well, I got to tell you guys, this glaze, it just caramelizes. It's so crunchy and amazing. Again, this is, you can see, this is, it's soft. It's not like hard. It's, you know, just packed tofu with the uh, flavoring. Absolutely delicious. We do highly recommend this if you've never tried it. 
Um, I am digging this. I usually do a spice brown mustard. We ran out, just got the old French's, but digging it, dunking it in. And we already know these pierogies were amazing because obviously we got these. They were amazing. How you how you digging it it's, over there, it's dude? It's crispy. It's caramel. It's like the candy, and then you get the meat. <laughs> It's not like super sweet as no. far as a glaze goes, no. but it's definitely kind of crunchy. Savory. Oh man, it's good. I'll yeah. tell you, this this is impressive. Uh, we, we haven't gotten it in quite a while. That's why Jack wanted to get it. Again, guys, if you want to try something awesome, if you've got plant-based folks in your family or you want to try something plant-based, this is really incredible stuff. Um, just, just amazing. Made in Oregon. It's, uh, it's, it's a winner. Tofurky's a winner every time. This stuff's great. Check it out. We'll put links and everything in the description. Like always, check out some of our other playlists. We do all this kind of Wellness Wednesday stuff. We try to show people healthy alternatives. No cholesterol. No saturated fat. Totally awesome. This is to die for. I got to smash a piece right now. We'll see you next time, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.